Good morning and welcome back to the channel. I'm Dawn. And I'm John. And together with the two, running brooms. So this morning you find us in the picturesque Yorkshire market town of Easingwold and we're going to take part in the Millfield Park Run. Now Millfield Park Run is a three lap course and it's a mixture of the field you can see behind us, the Millfield, <laughs> and a purpose built path which we are warming up on now. So interesting story behind Millfield Park Run, the local doctor surgery where we're part uh, and the local running club, Easingwold Running Club, got together a few years ago and decided they wanted a park run in their town. And this area was ideal for a park run, but for the fact the path was unrunnable for much of the year. So they got together with local businesses in the town, raised the money and got their park run up and running. So really well done. Can anybody think of any other examples of park runs that have been purpose built in the town? A purpose built park run. A perfectly picturesque purpose built park run. <laughs> Beat that. Not too cold this morning, is it, John? It is not too cold this morning, Don. <laughs> There's no wind this morning. So a little brain teaser for you. We're at Millfield Park Run. How many UK park runs are there with the word field in their title? Have a think about it. Don't Google it. Put it in the comments below and we'll see who gets closest to the correct answer. So before we carry on, we'd really like you to give this video a like, and if you haven't subscribed, we'd love you to do so. <laughs> so we're off on the 172nd Millfield Park Run. I would say this course has nice flowing undulations, isn't it? Yes. No big hills, but no real flat bits either. No, it was just nice rolling, of course. Good strength workout <laughs> on this lovely purpose built path. <laughs> so make sure you turn left at this point to stay in Millfield and not into those houses over there. So the lovely town of Easingwold sits 12 miles north of York, it has a population of around 4,500 and is at the foot of the lovely Hawardian Hills. So there's people all around, some on the way up, some on the way down. I'm trying not to hesitate, but I don't know how much longer I can wait. Mile 1, 8.25. Thank you. So since its inception in 2019, Millfield Parkrun has grown to have an average number of finishes per week of 147, an average finish time of 30.34, and if we check out the first ever event, we'll see a familiar name as the first ever female finisher. So on this park run we decided we would do it progressive. So we started off behind the 27 minute pacer and gradually worked our way forward in front of the 25 minute pacer. Here you can see that I'm having a little stride out at the end. I always like to have a little play at the end of park run. So on this occasion I decided to stay in Dawn's wake, mindful of the fact we'd done a session the previous day and we had a 20 mile run of the following day. A few inches later. So there we have it, Millfield Parker number 172, 202 finishers, 19 volunteers. So thank you very much to them. Thank you, cheers. So Millfield Park Run completed, we set off behind the 27 minute pacer and ended up just in front of the 25 pacer who incidentally did a splendid job, he must have finished in about 24.50, better than me last week. Let's have a little look and see what I've done on my watch, it says, just loading, it says it's loading, so it says 24.30. Well, how many UK Park Runs are there with the word field in their title? So if you remember that little parkrun pose that I set at the beginning, having checked, I think the answer is 32. 
Did you have a guess? How close were you to that answer? So, after you've completed the run, don't forget to have a short walk down to the beautiful town of Easingwold and enjoy the facilities available for you there. Yep, the town has 51 listed buildings to keep you educated, informed and entertained. We visited the Olive Branch Cafe you can see here for a delicious post run breakfast. So, we hope you've enjoyed this visit to Millfield Park Run. And if you have, please don't forget to give this video a like. If you'd like to see our further parkrun journeys, please subscribe to the channel and I'll put a link here to the previous 60 odd parkrun videos we have already made on this channel. So until next time, keep on keeping on. Keep on keeping on.